This is the Man Stop It Podcast. Man Stop It. Big Les, man, stop it! It's your boy, Big Les, man, stop it! What's the word? Got another story. Oh my good again, FBG Duck. I got another story on it, you know. Uh, I gotta speak up a little loud. My speak ain't that good. I gotta get a. Uh, Better microphone, but uh, I got a story on Duck, man. Uh, the last day we was together, uh, we was playing cards at his mama house, you know. And uh, you know that's all we did was play cards. Like I said, we played cards every damn day, damn day. You know what I'm saying? Uh, that's all he did if he wasn't going to kick it or nothing like that. But uh, he started slowing up on the, on the party, too. Mm-hmm. You know, I started seeing that he started falling back from all the kicking and going out club and, you know, doing all. He wasn't really going to no clubs. But, you know, they'll get together and they'll go party and shit like that. But he started falling back from a lot of that, you know what I'm saying? So, uh, yeah, he played cards, you know, in, in, in his spare time. You know, that's all he did. If he ain't at the studio or he ain't at home, he at his mama house and we playing cards. Uh, but this 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 day we was at his mother's house and uh we was playing some spades, you know, like we always do. You know, we be getting it in on the cards, you know what I'm saying? And uh we playing cards and stuff like that, so uh table and shit like that, and I was telling Duck about this song him and my daughter got, him and my daughter got a song together that they made about 10 years ago, uh, the song is old, but nobody really never heard the song, and this is my daughter's first song with her cousin, you know, uh, when she, when she asked him to jump on the song with her, he came and did it, you know what I'm saying, with no problem. Uh, we was at one of my homie studios on 87th and Union, over there, uh, over there around 87th and Union. One of my homies, he was one of the moles, he had a studio, he used to record. My boy Dion, you feel me? And, uh, me and my daughter went over there to the studio and we recorded the song, whatever. And, uh, I called my little cousin Duck, he slid, you know, he came over instantly, he slid right there. You know, pull right up by itself. He won with nobody. So when we come in there, you know, he in there, we in the crib, you know what I'm saying? And uh, it's my, my boy's people and some, a couple of little moles from over there. So when he come in, they like, damn, that's duck. You know what I'm saying? Like, that's duck. This is 87th and Union. So they like, man, this duck. Ooh, I'm like, they like, this duck. I'm like, yeah, that's duck. It's my little cub. You know what I'm saying? So Duck come right in, boom, we go get him, come right in the crib. You know what I'm saying? She, he heard TT, he heard my daughter TT verse or whatever, a hook and shit, he heard it. And he like, okay, cool, you know what I'm saying? He jumped right on that boy. You know, all he used to always say was, I'm waiting on her. I'm waiting on her, be good. I'm waiting on her, be good. You know, he always waited on her to when she ready. So when she was ready, he was going to jump on some of her music. You know what I'm saying? That's just what he used to do. He didn't. One thing about him, though, if he say he going to do something, he going to do it. If he say he going to do something with you, he going to do it. You know, ain't no uh, hold up and this and that. He, he don't care. Like, if when you ready, it's when he ready. He going to help you. He going to work with you. You feel me? So he bent right over there, helped up, whatever, you know. But, uh. We was at his mom's house, like I said, we was playing cards, and uh, 
And I was telling him about my daughter wanted to remix the song that I was talking about. The song was like 10 years old. So like I said, I told him that she wanted to redo it. So he was like, cool, we're going to do it. We're going to do it tomorrow. You know what I'm saying? But we were talking about doing something for my granny. This was the 3rd of August that me and Duck was together. This was the 3rd of August. Uh, the 4th of August, he was going to redo the song with my daughter. You know, we was going to barbecue. We was going to put some meat on the grill and everything that day. You know, he was going to go in the studio with her that day to redo the song. Uh, so we talked about it that night. That next day, you know, uh, that next morning, I had called up. Because we talked about getting together for our granny. You know, my grandmother, his great-grandmother. So we was talking about getting together for, uh, you know, her birthday was August 5th. So August 4th came, August 3rd is when we was talking about it. So I called him that next morning. It had to be like 9 something in the morning, maybe 10, 9 something in the morning. You know, he'd be at his mama house early, so he was at his mama house. So I was like, cuz, what's up, what we gonna do? You know what I'm saying? Like, what we gonna do? He was like, shit, cuz. You gonna fuck around over here at my mama house on the car. I'm like, all right, bet, shit. Uh, about what time? He was like, shit, I'm finna run downtown. And uh, I'm finna go get CJ something for his birthday. You know, his birthday, you know, when we go out of town. So I'm like, all right, he was talking about going to get him an outfit or something. I'm like, all right, bet. You know what I'm saying? She just let me know. You know what I'm saying? So he like, all right, cuz. You know what I'm saying? Then he was like, uh, yeah, me and, me and TT going to do that song. You know, we going to get together, go to the studio, and redo that song go. You know what I'm saying? So uh, we talked or whatever. You know, before he left, we talked. He was talking about he'll be back. He going to let me know. So... I called him back with maybe around two something, two something to check and see what was going on. And when I called him back, he was still downtown. So he was downtown or whatever, about two, three something. So he downtown, so I'm like, all right, yeah, you still downtown. He was like, yeah, cuz, I'm still downtown, but we gonna, we gonna, you know, get together and we gonna, you know, just let me know. So, okay, cool. So now I hung up. You know, I talked to him about two, three more times, right? So, like, I called him again. Probably about, about three something. Maybe close to four. So I called him again. Same thing. All right, good. Well, where we going to, you know, you know we just trying to figure out where we going to play at. This time. watching to see who going across his car. So some niggas ran across his car and he was watching them niggas. So uh yeah that was uh that was the last conversation that I had with my little cousin. We supposed to play cards that day man so and uh, that's the last time I talked to him so I just wanna say this to take you know uh man stop it. <laughs>